Hey everybody, welcome back to Royal Tarot Readings. This is my fun channel that I do for tarot readings on the royal family. All information presented in this video is for fun and entertainment purposes only. It's fun. It's tarot. I'm just a gal with cards. All right, so today, my goodness, the information that came out today. Well, Prince Harry's on his way to the UK and apparently he will not be able to meet up with his father, His Majesty King Charles. Nope. King Charles has said, I'm sorry, I just can't seem to find any room in my very busy schedule to meet with you. They're going to be two miles apart. Oh my goodness. Okay, well, let's take a look at this and see what's really going on. All right, so today I'm going to use the Baroque Tarot deck. Very nice tarot deck. And we will see what we can see about this interesting story. All right, so I hope everyone is well today. I am doing very well. Thank you very much. All right, shuffle alert. If you don't like my shuffling, please feel free to skip ahead. You will not hurt my feelings. I just want you to enjoy the video. All right, so let's take a look at this. King Charles doesn't have time to meet with Prince Harry. My goodness. Why did King Charles not find room in his schedule to see his son, Prince Harry? Why is King Charles not finding room in his schedule to see his son, Prince Harry? Did King Charles III purposely start back to royal duties to avoid seeing Harry? I noticed he started back to royal duties um, last week. And Prince Harry was coming this week. Isn't that very interesting on that timing? Did he purposely start back to royal duties to avoid seeing Prince Harry? How does Prince Harry feel about not being able to see his father? <gasps> the devil in reverse. Wow, he's not happy. He's very, very upset. All right, how does Prince Harry feel about not being able to see his father? And did Harry send a message to Catherine and William to try to get to see either one of them? Did Harry send a message to either Catherine or William to try to get to see them while he's there? And how does William feel about Harry? How does Prince William feel about his brother, Harry? Ooh. How does Catherine feel about Harry? And we have here the Two of Pentacles. Um, juggling, uh, juggling financial priorities. Kind of, kind of making plans with money. Hmm. Okay. So, how does William feel about Cath about uh, Prince Harry? And how does Catherine feel about Prince Harry? How does she feel about Prince Harry? The Chariot in Reverse. Uh, out of control. Change of direction. Not wanting to travel to see him. Okay, how does Catherine feel about Harry? And finally, will... Let me see, what's my question here? Oh, will King Charles ever get to meet either one of his... Uh, of Harry's children? The Two of Cups. Oh, he sure wants to. Will, Char will King Charles ever... Get a chance to meet either one of Prince Harry's children. Is that ever going to happen? All right, those are my questions. Kind of like want to see what's going on behind the scenes here. Why were these decisions made? All right, almost ready here. Maybe one more. All right, we're going to go with this one. Okay, interesting cut. All right, I have seven questions. We will do seven cards. All right, here we go. Here we go. Underlying energy is the Four of Cups. Apathy, not interested. <gasps> the Lovers in Reverse. Oh, and the Sun in Reverse. Okay, wow. Okay. Four of Cups. Things are being offered to you and you're just not interested. Apathy, eh, not interested. Wow. The lovers in reverse. Okay, lovers typically represent Harry and Meghan. Uh, this shows a split up. This shows a separation and they are separated right now as far as he's going to the UK, she's going to Nigeria. And the sun in reverse, keeping things hidden in the dark, not completed, uh, not being able to finish things. 
Oh, this is the star, not the sun. Oh my goodness, it's the star in reverse. Loss of hope. Not funny, I thought it was the sun. So upright, it's about hope and faith and and wishes. And in reverse, the loss of hope, the loss of faith. can also be a Diana card as well. Um, hmm, very interesting. Okay, all right, let's see where this goes. Why did King Charles III not find room in his schedule for Prince Harry? The Ten of Pentacles. This is the line of succession. Um, he doesn't feel he meets, that he uh, fits in with the line of succession. Oh my goodness. So this is, okay, so Ten of Pentacles is the line of succession. Why did he not schedule to see Harry? Because it would have interfered with the line of succession. Oh my goodness. This must be that Prince William didn't want him to. Uh, Harry's, or King Charles is really not interested in seeing him. Um, he won't be until they split up. He's he's lost hope and faith in Harry. Oh my goodness. He's lost hope and faith in him that he'll ever be back part of the family. Wow. Oh my. I wonder what that, that's about. I mean, we can guess, but okay. He didn't want to. He didn't want to see him because he's not, he doesn't, he's concentrating on the line of succession. Okay. Did King Charles purposely start back to royal duties to avoid seeing Prince Harry? Is that why he started back when he did? The Ace of Swords. Yes. Aces upright are always a yes. Ace of Swords is truth. That's exactly why he did it. He started back early. He started back last week because he knew that if he did, he had a perfect excuse not to see Prince Harry. I'm too busy. I'm so sorry. And in truth, he's just not interested in seeing him. He doesn't want to see either one of them. When they split up, he'll be interested in seeing Harry. But he's lost hope that that will ever happen. Did he purposely start back to royal duties to avoid seeing Prince Harry? He absolutely did. Wow. I was wondering if I would get an ace. I was like, I wonder how they're going to answer me. I wonder how the universe will answer me. Absolutely. Absolutely did. How does Harry feel about not being able to see his father? How does Harry feel about that? The hermit. Well, this is his archetype. All right. So he's upright. Um, he's withdrawn. How does he feel about not being able to see his dad? He's really not interested. He's lost hope as well. I think he's lost hope in his marriage from Harry's point of view. He's lost hope in his marriage because he knows that he's splitting up. He's lost hope in a lot of things. How does he feel about not being able to see his father? He feels withdrawn. He feels like I'm, I'm on my own. And he's losing hope. Wow. Well, I reap what you sow. All right. Um, did Harry send a message to either Catherine or William asking to see them? Oh, the King of Cups reverse. He sent it to William, and William was absolutely not interested. I can't believe I got that card. Did he send a message to Catherine or William? He sent a message to William, and William's like, absolutely not. I don't want to see you. I don't even want to see... Even after they split up, I'm not sure. He might be willing to see him after they split up. He's lost faith in him. Absolutely not. He sent a message to William, and William absolutely didn't even, didn't even bother to respond. Nope. Do not want to see you. Go away. Wow. I get such an icy cold energy out of that. Ooh, I got goosebumps. Icy, icy cold energy out of this. Upright, the King of Cups is very emotional, very, very helpful, very caring, and in reverse, basically, go to hell. Wow. Very unemotional, very cold. All right. How does William feel about Harry? How does he feel about his brother? The Nine of Pentacles in reverse. Oh, wow. So the Nine of Pentacles upright is about a very wealthy, usually a wealthy woman, prosperous, uh, wealthy, uh, usually single, and in reverse, a woman who is um, a drain, a woman who is a drain on resources and finance, uh, someone who has lost wealth, 
How does he feel about Harry? I'm not interested in anything having to do with you, your wife, your loss of money, your, um, I don't want to see you. I've lost faith in you. Even if he splits up with Megan, he is not interested in seeing him. How does he feel about him? Go away. And it's over the Ace of Swords, which is about truth. Your wife never tells the truth. This typically this sometimes can represent Megan. Um, your loss of your loss of prestige, your loss of money. I don't care. This is the truthful way I feel. I don't care about you anymore. I don't want to be there to help you with money. That's all you ever want from me is money. Has William feel about Harry? How does William feel about Harry? He just sees him as a drain on money, and he's not interested in seeing him. Lost hope in him, even if he splits up with Megan. Wow. I think William has crossed that line. You know that line that you get when you're splitting up with someone or you're thinking about it or whatever, and you know that if you cross that line, there's no going back? I think this is what has happened with William. He's, he's, he can't go back. He can't go back to feeling anything about Harry. Wow. That's just the energy I'm getting. Cold. Go away. I don't ever want to see you again. How's Catherine feel about Harry? Oh, right over the right over the card too, right over his archetype. How does Catherine feel about Harry? Oh, the Empress in reverse. Well, that definitely represents Megan, the mother who cannot be. Wow. I'm getting such goosebumps on this one. Okay. How does she feel about Harry? All she can see is this nasty, cold energy. Of a mother who's pretending to be a mother, allegedly, not interested in seeing him, lost hope, you guys split up, I don't even care if you split up, I never want to see you again. Completely cut out. Megan and Harry, right over each other. Wow. How does she feel about Harry? He's a package. He and Megan are a package and she, she, doesn't, she doesn't care about them at all. Don't ever want to see you again, go away. Wow. Lots of, uh, lots of Arcana cards here. My goodness. All right. Whew. Okay. Um, will Charles ever get to meet either of Harry's children again? The Page of Cups in reverse. Okay, so the Page of Cups upright... Um, is this is usually my um, good good messages, good news. Um, it's a very young energy. It can represent one of the children, but neither one of them are water signs that we know of. Of course, we don't know a lot about their birth. And in reverse, this is about um, bad news, bad messages, not not connecting. Is he ever going to meet either of Harry's children? I don't think he will. And at this point, he's not interested. He's not interested because he's lost hope. He's lost hope, number one, that these children are even what they're supposed to be, allegedly. Even if Harry and Meghan split up. What powerful cards. These are both Arcana cards, the lovers and the star. Will he ever get to meet the children? I don't think he will. Neither will William. This is about bad news, bad messages, something bad, something, something, um, emotional, um, distance, emotional cutoff. He would love to, I think, but because of this apathy card, he, he's lost hope that that will ever happen. I think he's lost hope that these children are even, are even there, allegedly. William knows. William is not interested at all. William has no interest at all. And I think Charles, for this, this is a bittersweet regret that he can't. Almost like, I so wish that I could, but it's not me not wanting to do it. It's that the children will never be there to meet me. Wow, what an interesting, wow. The children will never be there to meet me. 
Oh my. That can mean two different things. Wow. All right, let's do a wrap up here. Why did King Charles not put time in his schedule to see Harry? Because of the line of succession, the line of succession, he is not interested in having Harry even around the line of succession. <gasps> is that what it is? He's lost hope and faith in him. Even if they split up, he doesn't ever want to, he doesn't want to see Harry again, even if they split up. He's lost hope that they ever will split up. This is about uh, generational wealth. This is about the line of succession. He just is, uh, he's too busy concentrating on securing the line of succession. That's why he doesn't, he didn't want to see Harry. He didn't have time for him. Did King Charles III purposely start back to work to avoid seeing Prince Harry? He absolutely did. Absolutely did. 100%. Started back early so he'd have a good excuse not to see him because he's not interested in seeing him. He's lost hope. And it's it's because of the, it's because of them. Maybe No, even if they split up, he does, he's not interested. If this card weren't here, I'd say that he'll be interested once they split up. But this apathy card is saying, I'm not interested even if you split up. Wow. How does Harry feel about not being able to see his father? He's very withdrawn. Um, this is him. This is the hermit by itself is about withdrawal, uh, retreating back into yourself, pulling away from um, the world, just withdrawing into yourself. That's what he feels like. He just wants to withdraw into himself. Um, but he actually doesn't have any interest either because he's lost hope. Has he lost hope in his marriage? He might have. Did Harry send a mes message to either Catherine or Prince William? He sent a message to Prince William, and Prince William said, he didn't even respond. Absolutely not. Not interested. Go away. Don't ever want to see you again. Cold, cold energy. And that's Prince William's archetype. How does William feel about Harry? You're just a drain. You're a drain on money. You're a drain on me. You're a drain on my wife. I have no interest in seeing you. I've lost hope and faith in you. Mom would be so disappointed with you because that's a Diana card. Um, and even if you split up with your wife, I don't care anymore. Wow. He's definitely crossed that line. I get such a crossing the line feeling here. And how does Catherine feel about Harry? Go back to your wife. You and your wife are a package. I have no interest in you. You and your wife. Or you and your wife. All right, you're, you're one package, and I don't ever want to see you again. Go away. I've lost hope and faith. Split up if you want to. I don't care. Wow. Yikes. And then how does uh, King Charles, or will King Charles ever get to meet either of Harry's children? And um, uh, No, he won't. He'll never have the opportunity. It will never be presented to him. This emotional connection is just not there. And I think the, um, the, I, he thinks that they'll never even, they'll never be there for him to connect with. And he, he's lost, he's lost interest in it. He's not interested. Lost hope. And uh, even if they split up. Because he does, he has no faith in that. He has no faith that the children are there for him to meet. Allegedly. Wow. I am, I'm getting such an energy of, I'm done. Go away. I don't ever want to see you again. This entire, all these cards are just giving me that feeling. Wow. All right, there's your reading. I hope you enjoyed that. If you did, please like and share. And if you're a subscriber, why thank you so much. I appreciate all my subscribers. And if you're not a subscriber, will you need to subscribe? Come on and join us. We have a great community. We have some great discussions. Come on and join us on our adventure into the royal family. Thank you so much, everyone. Hope you have a great day. I'll see you again soon on Royal Tarot Readings. Bye-bye, everybody.